Hello and welcome. My name is April Ray, CEO and founder of the Introvert Mogul Studios. Thank you so much for joining me. Today I wanted to focus on some of the advantages of being an introvert. I know that, you know, everybody thinks that there, it's a disadvantage and a lot of times you feel like you want to be an extrovert and, you know, it's better. People f people perceive extroverts as better than introverts and it's not true. I'm sorry to say <laughs> that it's not true. Not everybody was meant to be the life of the party, all right? Not everybody was meant to be a tap dancing, woohooing extrovert. Some of us were meant to be deeper thinkers, and that is the introvert. So I am going to outline over the course of these next few videos the advantages of being an introvert, okay? So let's get started. All right, advantage number one. Introverts can charge their own batteries. Yes, we can, we can recharge ourselves and energize ourselves simply by being by ourselves, simply by having alone time. That is how we recharge ourselves. Whether we're reading a good book, whether we're contemplating something and looking outside the window, whether we're watching a movie and petting our dog, that's how we as introverts um, recharge our batteries as opposed to extroverts who actually need to be around a lot of people in order to feel some sort of, um, to get that energy recharge. I call them energy suckers. They're like vampires. Okay. <laughs> so they need to, they like to go out and they like to, you know, mingle with, with as much people because that's what gives them energy. And there's nothing wrong with that. You know, every, everybody to each his own, but for the introvert, being around a crowd of people seems to drain us and drain us of our energy. Now we do gain energy from people as well, but it's usually maybe one or two people at a time. It's not a big group of people. If we get around one or two of our besties and we start talking and, and, and having fun and being ourselves, that is energizing for us. But a big crowd of people like in network events, that is very draining. But the beauty is, is that we can be by ourselves and we can take that moment in order to re to re-energize ourselves. Um, extroverts, like I said, they have to kind of go out and find something to do. Otherwise they get bored. Um, so let me know what, as if you're an introvert, let me know what it is that you do to energize yourself. Me personally, now don't judge me, me personally, I like to watch a good fine episode of the uh, Housewives of... Beverly Hills, or maybe Married to Medicine, something like that. For some reason, that just gets me up in a roar <laughs> because they're crazy people. And it makes me feel like my life is really, really serene by watching them. <laughs> All right. So don't forget, let me know what is it that energizes you as an introvert. And I will see you on the next video. All right. Bye-bye for now.